So unblocking a toilet without a plunger. Um, this is going to be a quick demonstration uh, on, on how to do that with uh, a plastic bag, some tape and some scissors. Right, so what you need to unblock a toilet without a plunger um, is, a, is a plastic bag from, from any shop, you know, Tesco, uh, but other brands will work just as good. <laughs> um, some tape. I've, um, it doesn't, I, I've used really thin sellotape that you can, you know, that you use to wrap presents. Um, just but for this I've got um, some thick, um, quite quite decent um, gorilla tape, um, and a pair of scissors of course. Right here's the plastic bag. So I did see this on um, I saw it years ago on one of these, you know, uh, programs where they try and sell you a uh, like a gadget or some sort of you know thing to help you uh, do things like this unblocking toilets. But it was like a Quite an expensive piece of uh, piece of kit, um, but I just thought it's super simple and very easily just to make it at home, uh, and it wouldn't take you very long at all. So what you need to do is so we'll just I'll snip these handles off first, just to make it a bit easier. Um, and you know, and everyone's got plastic bags at home, everyone's got scissors, and everyone's got some form of tape. Um, I've got really strong tape just for the purposes of this video, but I have um, twice in the past had to do this um, once on uh, my own toilet and um, once on a on, on a friend's toilet when they were, they were stuck. So um, and I used uh, just you know normal packing tape, uh, or I used I used uh, cellar tape. Sorry. Um, well, to be fair, I used a combination of both packing tape and the brown tape and, and some cellar tape. So you don't have to have strong tape, but if you use less strong tape, you probably just have to put a bit more. Um, so anyway, so that's, I've got the size now. So I'm just gonna cut around the edges. Right, so I've got a rough, rough size of what I need. Right, so now all you have to do is simply tape the, the bag to the toilet and make sure it's airtight, make sure there's no, there's no um, gaps, air you know, able to get in. Right, so once you've taped the uh, the plastic bag to the bowl, it's secured and airtight, um, the next thing to do is flush the chain. So I'll flush the chain now. There we go. And then push. Nice. Shut sure. Should from a different angle. And there you have it. If you've done a, a good job of um, taping the sides to make it airtight, uh, you could do this multiple times. You can flush the chain, uh, push it down, um, you know, wait for the system to fill back up again, uh, flush it again. And you, could, you know, it, in my experience, um, it worked first time, both times I've tried it. Um, over the years, so you shouldn't need more than more than one attempt. But if you did, if the toilet was really blocked, then um, then yeah, you could just you know keep going as long as you've done a good job of taping it. Please consider subscribing to my channel. It would uh, really help my channel grow, and I'll be doing uh, weekly um, videos on handy home hacks. Thanks.